Welcome to the Explore the Universe channel, where we embark on a journey to discover the wonders of the world. In this video, we'll be exploring the unique architectural masterpieces of China, wonders that challenge both human strength and intellect. These structures are perched precariously on mountain peaks and steep cliffs, immediately giving the impression of a spine-chilling daredevilry, as if they could collapse at any moment. Yet, some of them have stood the test of time, for hundreds, even thousands of years. Standing before them, one can't help but wonder, how could the people of that time have accomplished such feats? They must have possessed an unwavering spirit, overcoming the harshest challenges of nature. The first structure is the Hanging Temple, also known as the Xuankong Monastery, which is nestled on the cliffs of Mount Heng in Hunyuan County, Shanxi Province. It is one of the most famous scenic spots in the region. According to many ancient texts, the temple was built in 491 during the Northern Wei Dynasty by a monk named Liao Ran. The back of the temple is supported by a concave rock face, while the front opens up to a magnificent valley. From a distance, the temple appears to be suspended in midair, defying the laws of nature. Over more than 1,500 years, the temple has undergone several renovations and expansions, becoming the colossal structure it is today. Notably, in 2010, the Hanging Temple was named one of the 10 most mysterious and terrifying architectural wonders in the world by Time Magazine. With its unique location perched on a steep cliff more than 70 meters above the ground, this architectural marvel commands admiration from all who see it. This unique location was no accident. It helps avoid floods and protects the temple from natural disasters such as rain and snowstorms. At the same time, its distance from the noise of animals and human activity allows the monks to meditate in peace and silence. The temple is designed in a distinctive architectural style, featuring a large monastery, two stories, and towers connected by a 32-meter-long suspension bridge with about 40 rooms. The two main towers, the North Tower and the South Tower, face each other and are surrounded by mountain corridors. Inside, there are six main halls and interconnected chambers, all together weighing more than 10 tons. Having withstood numerous earthquakes and natural disasters, the temple seems to be firmly anchored to the cliff by some mysterious force that we cannot explain. Some even believe that the temple's stability is due to the dozens of supporting columns hidden within, which have kept this structure standing through the ages. This temple, as a living testament to human willpower and resilience, will undoubtedly continue to stand as a symbol of greatness in architectural art. In fact, the support columns we see today were added long after the Hanging Temple was originally constructed. Their purpose was to stabilize areas that no longer had solid foundations and to reassure those concerned that the monument might collapse. However, what truly supports and holds the temple in place are the 27 wooden beams, which are deeply embedded into the cliff. These beams, known as Tai Bian Dan, are made from a special type of wood called Tai Sam, found only in the local area. The wood is crafted into square beams and then driven deep into the solid rock. To protect these beams from mold and corrosion, they are all soaked in tongue oil, a type of oil derived from the Vernicia 40 tree, native to China. The craftsmanship and arrangement of these beams require highly intricate techniques. To bear the weight of the entire structure, which totals up to 10 tons, each foundation point had to be calculated with precision. Some of the wooden beams were specially crafted to bear the weight, while others were used to adjust the height of the halls. Some were placed to increase the weight above, helping to maximize their supporting function. Certainly, this construction technique is incredibly creative and difficult to execute, and even with modern technology today, few could replicate it. The next architectural marvel consists of two small temples located at the summit of a split rock pinnacle on Mount Fanjing in Guizhou Province. This natural rock formation is known as Hong Yun Jin Ding, which means golden peak of red clouds, and it was recognized by UNESCO as a World Heritage Site in 2018. This is a sacred mountain that Chinese Buddhists regard as a place of enlightenment, similar to the Bodhi tree of Maitreya Buddha. The Buddha Temple and the Maitreya Temple are separated by a deep gorge, yet they are connected by a narrow stone bridge that spans across the majestic natural surroundings. These two small Buddhist structures have existed for centuries, and according to some researchers, they may have been built during the Tang Dynasty in the 7th century, approximately 1,125 years ago. After the Common Era, the temple to the south is dedicated to the Buddha Sakyamuni, 
symbolizing the present. While the temple to the north is dedicated to Maitreya Buddha, representing the future. What makes the Doi Temple famous and one of the most sought after pilgrimage destinations is the mystery surrounding its construction process. To this day, no documents clearly record how the materials were transported up the sheer rock mountain, adding to the temple's enigmatic allure. Despite undergoing several renovations and reinforcement with stronger materials to withstand the strong winds and harsh environment at such heights, the structure that visitors see today still maintains its original architecture. To reach this heavenly place, visitors must climb over 8,888 steps to reach the temple to the south, then walk across a narrow stone bridge to visit the temple in the north, symbolizing a journey from the present to the future. As visitors climb thousands of steps along the cliffs, they can admire ancient inscriptions dating back to the Ming Dynasty, proving that this has been a sacred pilgrimage site for a long time. Tourists from all over the world flock here to enjoy the breathtaking scenery of the Fanjingshan National Nature Reserve, home to over 2,000 plant species and hundreds of rare animal species. Thousands of years ago, this place witnessed the magnificent development of nature, and today it has become a fantastic destination for those eager to explore the pristine and sacred beauty of the natural world. The next structure we mention is the Kam Lu Nam Temple, hidden within a natural rock alcove, creating a scene that is both pristine and majestic. The entire temple is divided into four sections, with the central part supported by a 30-meter tall, Lin Sam wooden column, standing firm as a symbol of endurance and sturdiness. The other sections are built against the rock face, forming a grand and imposing structure. The temple is paved with red bricks, clearly reflecting the architectural style of the Song Dynasty, with every detail bearing the distinctive mark of that era. Building a temple on such a cliff is undoubtedly no easy task, but what is even more astonishing is that the entire structure was built without using a single nail. Instead, ancient architects employed the technique of wooden joinery, allowing the parts of the structure to connect securely without the need for any intermediary materials. This technique not only ensured the temple's durability over time, but also reflected the profound philosophy of yin and yang, as well as feng shui, creating a perfect harmony between architecture and nature. This ingenuity has left future generations in awe of the ancient architects, for in an era without modern technology, they relied solely on their hands and intellect to precisely calculate every small detail of such a grand structure. Despite the many challenges in its construction, the position of the Kam Lu Num Temple on the sheer cliff also offered certain advantages. The entire cave is shaped like an inverted triangle, with the rock face above protruding like an umbrella providing shelter. This design helps protect the temple from rain and falling rocks, while also creating a space that remains dry and well lit. The temple is supported by only a single column, yet it has stood firm for nearly 900 years without ever wavering. This structure commands such respect that even modern architects bow in admiration. Thus, we've explored the unique ancient architectural wonders of China. Do you feel admiration for the ancient monks who skillfully chose such challenging locations to build their temples? Thank you for watching the video, and we look forward to seeing you in our next videos.